Circus returns from the destructive flip in Syracuse with driver Chip Hanauer. The Mr. Pringles with Scott Pierce also once again put together and running fast. Larry Lauderback in the Winston Eagle is looking for his second win and more national points. While Tom Deeth in the Miss Budweiser looks to repeat his win of last year on the Columbia River. ESPN presents the HFC American Hydroplane Series. This seventh stop, the Budweiser Columbia Cup. Twelve of the world's fastest race boats are here on the Columbia River to do battle for the Budweiser Columbia Cup and national points as the hunt continues at straightaway speeds approaching 200 miles per hour for the championship. The HFC American Hydroplane Series is sponsored by Household Finance Corporation, America's financial resource. Pringles, the fever reliever. Blockbuster Video, America's family video store. Hello, everybody. I'm Jim Hendrick, along with Dick Crippen, here on the Columbia River, Tri-Cities, Washington, made up of Pasco, Richland, and Kennewick, if you will. It's the seventh stop of the HFC American Hydroplane Series and the first stop on the West Coast, Dick. That's right, and right off the bat, we've already had an accident. We haven't even started racing today. Circus Circus went out, and the winds were a little gusty this morning, but they say it didn't have anything to do with the weather. When I talked to Mel Larson, though, the owner rep for Circus Circus, well, it was another sad story to be told. All right, Mel, uh, again, a uh, sad news story for the Circus Circus. Well, that's true. The boys were really hard, you know, getting the, uh, the rudder fixed, and as you can see, it broke loose again, the, uh, the bracket, the mechanism that holds it in there. Just let go as he was coming down the straightaway. He had a good hard lap, 137 miles an hour, even though it was just his first warm-up lap, so we figured we were in the hunt again. But the veer, boat veered to the right hard, went to the left, and got up on its side, and, uh, and that's the end of it uh, for today. And uh, we just can't fix it, and the crew will not fix it. We're going to let him go out where it's not right, where he can run hard and run safe, and uh, so we're out of it for today. Chip Hanner is okay. Yes, uh, fortunately, that's the main thing and the important thing, that Chip came out all right. So as we said, it didn't appear to be weather-related. Let's take a look at how the weather is right now. The Fruit of the Loom weather shows us it is 76 degrees, low humidity. Winds are 10 to 15 now, gusting up to 20. So it looks like it's actually improving at this point, Jim. Come right down to it now with the Circus Circus out of competition. That means that the Winston Eagle with Larry Lauterbach and, of course, the Mr. Pringles with Scott Pierce will have to step up to be counted to take on the Miss Budweiser and Tommy Deeth. You see it that way? Yes, I certainly do, and it's going to be interesting because, uh, you know, on our rough water courses so far, Winston Eagle has ridden very well out there, and the Pringles boat, after it was repaired from the last race, came back and went at 148-plus miles an hour in qualifying. So definitely they've got the problems taken care of in that boat now. We've got a lot of action coming here from Tri-Cities, Washington, on this two-mile over Columbia River. And Dick and I will have it all for you in just a moment. consecutive world title and 10th world championship. She's Bernie Little's Miss Budweiser. Miss Bud, Miss Bud, Miss Bud's for you. 